is recognized. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I want to get one thing straight for our members on the other side of the aisle. The only shutdown that we are in favor of is a shutdown of the woke indoctrination in our military, the shutdown of the infection of socialism propagated by the other side, and a shutdown of the bloated government spending and the, re uh, the overreach of regulation in America. Now onto my main point. I rise today to condemn in the strongest terms possible, Mr. Speaker, the blatant attacks on the Second Amendment from the governor of New Mexico. We saw with COVID unprecedented government overreach that infringed on the rights of millions of Americans. Let me be crystal clear, Mr. Speaker, there is no such thing as a state public health emergency exception in the U.S. Constitution. No such thing. The Second Amendment is a God-given right to the American people. We will not sit idly by as the people of New Mexico have their rights trampled by an unhinged lunatic. Throughout history, countless populations have been rendered vulnerable due to their inability to defend themselves from both external and internal threats. Our founding fathers, with great foresight and understanding of history's lessons, enshrined the right to bear arms not only as a protection from foreign invaders, but also as a safeguard against potential domestic tyranny. I urge my colleagues to support House Resolution 684 and push back against the attacks on we the people's God-given rights. I yield back. Thank you. The gentleman from Missouri yields back. The gentleman